DIY for and today I'm going to show you how I turned an old sweater into two stockings for the holidays. Really simple to do and really affordable. This is a no sew project so let's get into it. So grab an old sweater or pick one up from the thrift store. I also have yarn here for my decoration. You can use beads as well. I didn't end up using mine. A hot glue gun if you want to do no sew. You can use a needle and thread if you like and also scissors and a piece of chalk. So chalk is just used to outline the shape and size of your stocking. That's what I'm doing here. I eyeballed mine and then I pinned my sweater together just before I decided to cut it in part just so that a, the fabric didn't shift at all. So cut it out and probably leave about an inch away from the design that you traced out. This is what my stocking looked like when I was all done. And then you're going to want to flip the good sides facing together. I simply just hot glued around the edges of my stocking where it would be sewn. And again, you can stitch this together or you can throw it through the sewing machine as well if you are handy like that and maybe you want a better hold. Flip it all inside out once you're done and then we're going to use some yarn to create some puff balls which is uh, really really easy to make pom-poms wrap it around your two fingers I slide I slid it off my fingers and then I grabbed a nice long piece of yarn and I'm tying a knot around the ball that I just created there so as you can see you'll have these edges here that need to be cut open all of those loops cut them free then you can trim up your pom-pom when you're all done and shape it into a nice circle and fluff it up um, I actually made two pom-poms for each of my stockings Make sure you leave that long strand that you knotted around the ball of yarn attached. So now we have those long strands that we can tie these two together and then attach them to the stocking. So I simply just hot glued it into place into one of the seams, trimmed off any of the excess edge. Now to hang my stockings, I just braided three pieces of yarn together to create a stronger hold and a wider band. And then I knotted each of them on, the, uh, on each end and then I hot glued it into place on the inside of my stocking right next to where I glued the pom-poms in. doesn't take very long to do and it is a great way to get rid of an old sweater and if not you can just go to the thrift store and pick one up like I did. Have fun with it, be creative and embellish them in any way you like. I kept mine pretty simplistic and if you're wondering what that thing was that the stockings are hanging up on, no it's not a fireplace it's just this weird brick wall type thing that kind of looks like a fireplace in my apartment. Honestly I've had so many conversations with friends trying to figure out what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, if you enjoy this DIY, let me know, give me a like. You can try it out for yourself too, and if you do, I'd love to see the photos of what your stockings look like. So send me some photos on Instagram and on Twitter. You can follow me at Janelle Steeper, and then just use the hashtag to DIY for if you tag me in any of those photos. Don't forget, every Wednesday I put out a new DIY video, so subscribe, and I'll see you then. Cheers. <laughs> Thank you.